Hello everybody, it's QCow, and today we're playing Shinobi Strikers. I've been playing a lot of this game recently, and uh, I gotta say, I'm getting a little bit better at it. I've got like 52 hours logged in on this thing. Not, not as many as some of these other people. I kinda got the game late. But as you can see, my win rate overall is like 44%, and that's recently started to climb. I think it was like 39 before. So I've started to climb on that. Uh, the last 10 battles, so it looks like out of 10 battles, I'll win 8 of them. And that's pretty good. Um, I haven't done any ranked. Like I said, I got the game pretty late. Um, but I have been putting in the work to get better at it. What else can I say? Like, as soon as I feel like I've got the mechanics down, I'll probably go into ranked and I'll record that for you guys. I think this is going to be a mainstay on the channel, just because of how much I've been playing it. Um, the roles that I have been using, if you got, like, if you guys haven't gotten into this game or you don't know much about it, there's different roles on top of the character creation, right? It's freaking dope. I wish I had more items, though. Um, there's attack type, hill type, defense yeah. type, and range. And I mainly play heal and attack type. Mainly because I don't know how to play tank or defense type, and I sure as hell don't like playing ranged. Like, I've never liked playing a ranged type character. Ooh, shit, what are we. Flag battle? Uh, okay, so I'm gonna tell you right now. I don't know if the enemy team, they do. Is some guy backed out? What a loser. Okay. What was I talking about? Yeah. Like, I just can't get in range. Mages, marksmen, never been able to play them. It's kind of boring for me. Alright, so there's also four game types. Capture the flag. Uh, base, or domination basically is base capture. And then there's just a straight up team deathmatch. And barrier battle, which is you have to... Put, you, the objective of that one is you go... If you're defending, you have to defend these two stakes... Uh, that the enemy is trying to pull out and when they do pull it out it opens up your boss and if they manage to beat your boss in the time limit then you lose and vice versa you know you beat their boss you win da 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 but the reason I chose this or uh, this this healing slot I have like three healing slots and one attack slot my attack slot this. works for almost everything uh, but my heal slots are really uh, situational for capture the flag, most tanks like to run that uh, sand shield crap. One of them's probably running subterranean voyage, and then the other one's probably running like human boulder. But uh, to get rid of sand shields, what you want is paralysis jutsu or almighty push if you're an attack type. Oh, shit, that's bad. Gotta stay low. I'm gonna go after the healer as fast as possible. We're gonna back out. I don't know where my homie went. Uh, try to get that guy off. Maybe I can. Damn! I'm healed. I don't know where my homie is. My homie's over there. I gotta get to him. Let me see if I can paralyze somebody. That's all I gonna do. We're gonna keep him busy. Oh, that lag! I know y'all saw that. That was some wolf. That was some straight up shit. Oh, I care like that, We're gonna go after him. Force him to sub. Ah, uh, give me that booty! I want it! Hold on, buddy. Hold on, you're not gonna get the best of me like that. Oh, somebody... I don't care about you anymore. Recover. Okay, nice, nice. I need to get over there, but this guy is on my freaking case. If I can just get over there and pop a heal, yes! That's what I wanted. Actually, oh. Oh shit, I got sealed. Time to get the fuck out of here. Woo! Nice try, fella. I forgot I'm running, uh, not running the thingy. The one I really like. I'm gonna pop a heal here. I need to go back, though. He's pretty low. Oh shit! Oh man, that o that was almost really bad. Hey, hey buddy. 
How you doing? Cellular extraction juice. Hi there. I need to heal him like one more time before I can leave. I want him at full health. No. Get out of here, boy. Ah, oh, fuck it, snake, fuck it. You just wanna. Alright, we're gonna. BAP! Both of them off the point. Also, I don't know where my homie is. I'm gonna just pop that just a bit. Wait. Put him to sleep, boys. Wait, I'm gonna kill him. Oh, he's dead. Get out of here! Get out of here! Nobody likes you. Fucking up my steez. Okay. Oh. I fucked up the castle. That's so bead. Ooh. You okay, bud? Fuck. Cut that out. Oh, oh, there Just need a couple more. Okay, we got him. Whew. All right. Successfully defended. Gonna pop, pop a heal here. Can't see a damn thing. Oh fuck! Hey, buddy. What you doing over there? Oh shit! This makes him the again. Yeah, you get out of here. He's pretty good at defending. That's a good threat. Little snakey snake. Oh, we're just gonna. Uh, that. But we did not. I think the healer is behind us now. We should be dealing with him. This guy is gonna try to do. Like, get out of here! Still got him. That'll work. I don't mind that. We just wanna keep him busy. Well, my guy deals with the healer. Come on, come on, yo. There we go. Get him off the mix. I'm gonna touch him for a little bit. Somebody touched him. Hey, buddy. Okay, that was gonna work. Don't wanna use the soap for that. Alright, what I want to do is get over here real fast. Can't tell what the hell just happened. I need it. Pop heal real fast. Ah, get me up there! My movements aren't so great. Okay. There you go, buddy. Put him to sleep, boys! I'm gonna hold him here. Alright, boy. Block. I don't care about him. I want this guy. You gotta hit him with that, man. You gotta hit him with that. These tanks are annoying! Oh, holy shit, I'm over. Get off my point! God damn. Where am I? Where's he? Oh shit! Ah, there we go. Oh wait, did he drop the flag? Oh, he did drop the flag. 
Uh, got it. All right, it ends in the draw. <laughs> That's sort of like that's sort of how capture the flags usually go. Like if you're not rocking mics, it'll usually go this way. Two tanks, man. Like what the? That's some cheese shit. I hate. I really do hate that. Like tanks are point runners on um, capture the flag, just because they can get away with a lot of bullshit. And if your team's not running the right stuff to get them off. Your flag or get them away from their flag it's pretty much just gonna be a stalemate uh, provided one person knows how to counteract that crap uh, that dude did not use a spiky boulder well then again I didn't do so hot my damn self uh, I feel like yeah if I definitely didn't go back though to heal that guy and then defend that freaking onslaught of just three minutes of dudes just throwing themselves at us, we definitely would have lost that. He couldn't have hold that by himself. Then again, the draw is not really all that better. So anyway, yeah, that's pretty much... Uh, I'm going to leave this lobby. Actually, I'm going to end the video, but I'm going to show you guys, like, my little setups and stuff. Um... Only really ha like most people have multiple. They have only one role. Game freaked out on me there. They only have one role that they use constantly, but I have two, and it's heal and attack. Mainly heal because heal has a lot of utility behind it. But if people uh, people usually like pick one thing and they stick with it. Um, I have three healing slots, and one attack slot, and the reason I only have one attack slot is because. Pretty much this is all I need for any game mode, be it capture the flag, uh, base capture, combat, or uh, barrier battle. This works for everything. I have almighty push to get people off of me, to break tanks guards when they put up their sand shield, to get them off points, uh, lightning lariat to catch people if they try to get away, or if I need to get away just pop it and zoom out of there. Uh, planetary devastation is like a, it's the best, it's just the best freaking attack ult in the game. It's got, you hit somebody, it, it sucks them up, takes away their substitution jutsu, and anybody in the surrounding area around them also gets sucked up and in one shot kills. So, it, it, like, Barnes Hill Strike is supposed to do the same thing, but it's finicky, like, super finicky. Like, it does, it shit doesn't work. At least I feel like it doesn't work. Massive Brazingon is alright. But like planetary devastation does it a lot better. It's definitely Massive Brazingon is definitely better than Baruto Strike though. Like I'll let you guys read each one on your own. Get a feel for that. Uh, lightning style chakra mode makes it to where you're like a little bit faster, you attack faster, and you can't be knocked back. Uh, Seven heavily breaths heals you and it boosts your like attack power. That's pretty much it for that. Use substitution jutsu because it just comes back the fastest. Uh, gives me health back, shortens uh, cooldown timers, and then makes it so I can extend my combos. Uh, I know a lot of people like to use like paralysis kunai. Uh, some use smoke bombs. I don't really like smoke bombs. Uh, I just used the basic kunai. Like, basic kunai is god kunai. The crap has so much utility. It stops jutsus. It stops people from flying at you. If you hit them three, t like if you catch them in a combo, and then you hit them three times with the kunai. They can't recover. So if they're over a pit, they just fall to the death. Uh, uh, if somebody's trying to run away, you can hold them up for like. If somebody on your team has a jutsu that can catch up to them, there's so much utility. For just the basic kunai, I feel like it's the best thing, like out of all the tools in the game. Um, now, as far as heal types go, I'm not gonna go over the accessories too but or too much. But I have cellular extraction jutsu for this slot, and heavy boulder jutsu, and then my toy regeneration. And this one is 
mainly used, sometimes for capture the flag, but mainly used for barrier battles. And the main reason is, if my team's holding down a point, I need to heal them, but if somebody's on a stake, I can hit them with the heavy boulder jutsu, and it, that, it says it boosts their defense, but it's not by much. Um, it slows them down a hell of a lot. Like, if they get hit with it and then they sub, they have a hard time getting back to the stake. Uh, same with flags. Uh, base for bases is not too good because most have tanks and they run uh, Senshu. It's, it's not so good. Uh, my Toic Regeneration is pretty good uh, for if somebody, like, I need my team to come back, say they did get the stake out, or if they're about to get the stake out, but I know I can bring my team back. This will revive my teammates, and we can keep going. Uh, the other one... Uh, this one is my beat the crap out of everybody heal spot. And it's basically aggressive support. Um, I'm healing myself with this one, because I'm basically a tank in this, in, with this setup. They try to target me, they waste time because I just heal too much back, and they can't really kill me. Chakra Scalpel cuts off people's ninjutsus, they can't use them anymore. Uh, Paper Clone Jutsu does the same thing. The uh, only difference is it's like it leaves a cloak behind, and if they keep attacking it, boom, they get hit by it, and their juice is sealed. Um, and I use this one. I think this is really great. This is a really great ult. Uh, it basically does an explosion for the first round, and the second part of it, it heals. So it's like kind of a combat medic type deal with this one. It's pretty good for clearing points, and if your teammates need that burst healing, you can get it. This bad boy is all about capture the flag and base battle. And I say that because in capture the flag and base battle, uh, there's always one thing that they have in common. And it's those defense types running sand shield. And paralysis jutsu will get you through sand shield. Like it'll, it'll stop, it'll, par it'll paralyze them and cancel their jutsu. Uh, again, just for a heal, burst healing. Feather Illusion Jutsu will put everybody to sleep. You guys saw that when I used it uh, in the last match. And it just puts everybody to sleep. You can cancel it, they'll still be asleep, and then you can beat the crap out of them. Uh, also, I like... I don't run this in the other sets, but I really love... <laughs> I really love the frying pan. It is probably the worst weapon in the game, but I love it. To death. This is... It's like, when you see something so ridiculously funny that you could beat the crap out of people with, you gotta use it. Like, I gotta use it. It's just, the sound effects are just, boom, boom, just beating the crap out of somebody. And if they lose to that, they've gotta be like, damn, I got beat up by a heel using a goddamn frying pan as a weapon. <laughs> there could be no, no greater humiliation. Well, anyway. I've let this video run on for too long, and the video quality is ass. I'm going to try to fix that for you guys in uh, future videos. But, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will be putting out many more like this on the channel, because I really do enjoy playing this game. So, if you if you like it, please leave a like. Maybe even comment. Tell me. Just tell me anything. Really. Uh, I'm begging. Please, give it to me. Or subscribe. That'd be even better. Subscribe and come back every day. Watch my videos. Like, comment, and... Get more people, you know, share that shit. You get me out there. I know you guys can do it. You're holding out on me. I don't like it. Stop it. Alright, stop. Well, guys, hope you have a good one. I'll see you later. Where's the... Damn it. Every time.